Hello everyone, Ruby here. Um, this video is for anyone who's having issues running watering waves on their uh, Windows computer, especially if it was downloaded from the Epic Games Store. Now, I also downloaded watering waves from the Epic Games Store, and when I attempted to play the game through the Epic Games Launcher, it's not working at all. And so this is watering waves. I keep clicking on it, nothing's occurring at all. I, if I even close out Epic Games Launcher, if I end task real quick, and I go ahead and open it up again, it's going to open up, and you can see here, it's just saying that it's running, even I haven't even clicked it yet, it's just saying running, when you mouse over it. And so, I'm assuming this is some kind of bug in regards to how the Woodrun Waves Launcher interacts with the Epic Games Store Launcher itself. So, um, now, there's a uh, quick and easy fix in regards to how to get this done. And for starters, I also want to apologize in regards to how the video looks. Um, this, I'm showing this using the second monitor on my dual monitor setup, which is a 21 by 9 aspect ratio. That's why it looks weird like this. But anyway, back to what we're talking about. So, Wooden Raves is now running on your computer. Easy fix. The first thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up Task Manager. Once you have Task Manager open up, like I have on my right hand side here, Go ahead and look for where it says um, Epic Games Launcher as the apps. Select it and end task. You can end task using the um, button here or you can right click and just click end task. It'll end the task itself. Now the next thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up Windows Explorer. Now with Windows Explorer you want to browse to the location of Wooden Waves. So you go to your um, this PC where it shows the list of hard drives you have. Now on my PC I have multiple drives that I use for different things. Um, some I have for Client, client work, some I have for private stuff, family related stuff, and some I have for my games. Now, uh, mine's, mine is installed on my game's um, hard drive, but your typical user will have it installed on the C drive. So I'm going to walk you guys through on how to locate the folder on your C drive, and then I'll show you what it looks like on my end with it being installed on my E drive here. So with C drive, you want to double click it. Now on the C drive, you want to look for where it says program files not program files x86 you're looking for where it just says program files you double click program files under program files you're looking for where it says epic games uh, you double click the folder that says epic games and once you go into that folder you see the list of games you've downloaded from epic store and so you lo you're looking for the folder that says watering waves and it's going to have some extra gibberish at the end once you locate the folder double click in it go into the folder now you want to look for a file named launcher. Now once you see the file named launcher, just double click it and it will open up the um, actual launcher for wood woodring waves for you. Now I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like on my end. So I'm going to go back to my um, this PC here and then I'll go to games which is where mine is installed. I can see I have Epic Games here. I'll go ahead and click Epic Games. I can see I have wooden waves and with the extra gibberish I was talking about. So I'll go ahead and double click wooden waves. Now in this folder here, I'm going to scroll down like I stated earlier. I'm looking for this file that says launcher. I'll double click it. Your Windows user access control is going to come up. Just click yes. And once you click yes, it's going to show the launcher right here for you. And from here, you can just click start to go ahead and start playing the game. Now. Going to this folder every single time you want to play the game can be tedious and annoying. And so what you want to do here is that in this folder, go ahead and select Launcher, like I have it selected here. Right click it. Now, since I'm using Windows 11, just go ahead and click on Show More Options if you're using Windows 11 also. If you're not using Windows 11, um, if you're using older versions of Windows, you already have this drop down here. Now, once you've clicked Show More Options, you want to go to where it says Send To. And under Send To, you want to go to Create Desktop Shortcut. Now, when you do Create Desktop Shortcut, it's going to create a shortcut for you, which is what it did for me here. And then once it's created, that's going to say Shortcut to Launcher. And so what you want to do is you want to just right-click that shortcut and rename it, which is what I did. I renamed mine to Woodrun Waves here. And that's it. That's the fix right there, or the temporary workaround till they fix the main issue itself. And that's it, guys. I um, hope you guys enjoy Wooden Waves as much as I am. I'll be making some other videos um, I'll be releasing later on today in regards to my experiences with the game itself. And so that's it. I won't keep you guys any um, longer than I have to. 
Happy gaming, everyone. Peace.